Hey everybody, hope you made it through Monday just fine and got that little motivation going from yesterday. And today on this Tip Tuesday, I wanted to talk about getting a good stretch through the upper back and shoulders. I hear a lot from my PT clients and a lot from the members through the gym that they hold a lot of their tension and their stress from the week in the upper back area. So I wanted to give you something that you could do pretty much anywhere because all you need is a surface to rest the arms on. So a chair, table, um, bench. I'm gonna use my ottoman today because that's what I got out here in the living room for a very uh, passive stretch. So I'm not sure what to call this first one, but I think of it like a modified child's pose. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna keep the arms out straight. Hands are gonna be on the object and you're just going to hang out, bringing the head down between the arms. So I'm not actually trying to force myself down there, but I'm just chilling, letting gravity do the work here. If I want to intensify the stretch, I can scoop back so that more of my palm is on it. And when I'm feeling that stretch, I'm feeling it through the lat, kind of where that arm um, enters the socket on the outer shoulder here, a little bit into um, the upper trap. So that's a good first option to get into that back area would be that modified child's pose. Another one to get more kind of into the tricep is that similar position, but instead of having the hands planted on here, we're gonna go elbows. So elbows go on the edge. I'm gonna poke my head down just like I did earlier, but now I'm gonna reach to the upper back with my palms. So here I'm getting a real intense stretch, not only through the shoulders, but now through the triceps as well. Again, I'm not forcing myself down here. I'm just kind of letting gravity do the bit. And then when I'm done, I'm going to straighten out those arms nice and slow. And then I'll raise out of there. Okay. So you got two options there to get into both the tricep and the upper back shoulder area. I hope you guys try that out and get some relief. And I'll see you guys on the next one.